Have you ever heard the word victory? What does victory mean to you? Winning a game? An army defeating their enemy? Getting first place? The most important victory was very hard to win. Just one man had the power to save many people from a terrible punishment. But to win, he had to take their punishment, even though he didn't deserve it. That man was Jesus. We know who Jesus is and what he did because of the Bible. It is God's true word. It tells us that Jesus is God the Son. He is perfect. Jesus showed his amazing love and power by doing things that only God could do, like bringing dead people back to life. He came to earth and told people that God loves them, and he showed them how they could become friends with God. But even though he was good and full of love, some people still hated Jesus. They were his enemies. Are you God's enemy? Anyone who sins against God is his enemy. When you think, say, or do things that go against God, that is called sin. You were born wanting to sin. You were made to be God's friend, but your sin separates you from him. The punishment for sin is death. That means being separated from God forever. But God made the way to save you from that punishment because he loves you. He did that through Jesus. Jesus never sinned, and he shouldn't have been punished, but his enemies arrested him. They lied about Jesus and said that he had sinned. Some soldiers made fun of him and beat him. But his enemies didn't think that hurting him was enough. They wanted him to be killed. So the soldiers nailed his hands and feet to a wooden cross, and they hung him on it to die. While he was on the cross, his enemies made fun of him. It looked like Jesus was defeated. If he was so powerful, they thought, why didn't he save himself? But Jesus did have the power to save himself. He chose not to because he knew God's bigger plan, to save people from their sin by dying for them. Jesus didn't come to defeat these enemies. Jesus even asked God to forgive the people who hurt him because he loved his enemies. Jesus is God the Son who saves and loves you too, even though you have been his enemy. God made you, knows everything about you, and wants you to be his friend. So he gave his perfect son, Jesus, to take the punishment you and I deserve. Jesus chose to be punished for his enemies, including you, by dying on the cross. After six hours on the cross, Jesus hung his head and died. Suddenly, there was a big earthquake. When the soldiers saw what had happened, they looked at Jesus and thought, truly, this man was the Son of God. After the soldiers made sure he was dead, Jesus' friends put him in a tomb. It was a very sad day for them. But it wouldn't last forever, because on the third day after he was killed, Jesus came back to life. Jesus won the victory over the real enemy, death. Only Jesus could do this because he is the perfect son of God. Jesus won the greatest victory of all time, and he is ready to save you from sin's punishment so you can become God's friend and have eternal life. The Bible says in John 3, 36, whoever believes in the Son has eternal life. To believe in Jesus, God the Son, means to trust that he is the only one who could take your punishment for sin and that he came alive again for you. When you believe in Jesus, God forgives you and gives you eternal life. You will enjoy friendship with him that starts now and lasts forever. God promises that he will always be with you and help you with everything that happens in your life. God will also help you to have victory over sin. He will give you the desire to live in a way that pleases him and help you to say no to sin. 
You can talk to God about what you believe right now. You can tell him you are sorry for your sin and that you believe in Jesus who won the victory over death and came alive again for you. Tell God you want to live his way with his help. Will you believe in Jesus today?